Hello, dolls. Happy Thursday. And today on the vlog, I have been filming videos, hence the mess that you see. So I'm taking a break because I feel like I did quite a bit of work. I feel somewhat accomplished. But I do still have to try on the outfits for my um, try on portions. So all of these clothes that are here, I do have to try on. Um, and then I do still have a few other fashion videos that I need to film. But <clears throat> I don't want to film all my videos in one day like with the same look. So I may wait and do those later. But I did film a makeup tutorial as well today. And some other reviews and stuff. Oh, and I may do my um, <clears throat> doll dilemma or doll discussion today as well, if I remember. But I need a break, so I also need to eat. So, of course, you know, I called in to see if she ate already. And I actually called a little bit too late because she was already picking up something to eat but she ended up just um getting the food and bringing it to her mom so we're still gonna go and eat and i've really been wanting some crawfish etouffee so we're gonna go to a place called floyd's um and i'm gonna get like a cup of gumbo and stuff too because i'm greedy af it just on fleek but yep i just put this on because it went well with my eyes so i did this tutorial I'm going to call it Pink Lemonade. So it has like the pink and yellow. I don't know why this camera is not focusing today. So I had put on this shirt to film because I think that it popped really nicely with the yellow. So I just decided might as well wear this today, right? So I just put on some jeans and some sneakers. And the weather looks really bad here. So it's supposed to rain. Don't mind Versace's blanket, but it's supposed to rain and get pretty bad here. So I didn't want to wear my white sneakers. Um, and then I kind of wanted to tie in the color. So I was trying to think like, I don't really have sneakers with yellow. So I need to get me some because I love me some yellow. But these, if you can see, it does have yellow and just like a lot of multicolors. But these are a pair of old coach sneakers that I've been having. And I was like, hmm. This would be cute for today like it matched my shirt and i don't care if they get wet or whatever so if it rains i don't you know i won't be tripping but yeah i was trying to use that for some light but i'm waiting for india to be ready to go um i don't know what the hell she's doing was taking her so long because all i really had to do was put on some pants and sneakers or shoes may i say but thank you versace can you move please thank you but um yeah because i was already ready since i was filming and i actually film in my bodysuit and i don't put pants on so i just had to put some jeans on and sneakers so i'm about to answer some stuff that i got on um snapchat I don't know. I can't even think right now because I'm like so freaking hungry. And I have been wanting some crawfish etouffee because last week, I don't think I vlogged it, but I had got my grandma to make me some okra shrimps and sausage. So I don't know. It kind of just like both of those dishes or something that I have rarely. And probably like some weeks ago, whenever we went to Papa Do's, um, I didn't get the crawfish etouffee, but I tasted it again, and I was like, ooh, I should have got this. Like, So now I've been wanting some, and then my mom rubbed it in because yesterday she had some crawfish etouffee and some other stuff. So we're going to go and eat, and yeah, I'll probably bring the camera. Oh, and then I need to come back home and film some more videos because India has to go somewhere anyways supposedly um but if not then i'll just wait till later because we're gonna go to hookah <laughs> as always we went there the night and we went really late and i thought maybe i should grab my camera and vlog but i didn't i know you guys want to be in the mix but 
on my last video I had just posted it the same day that we went the other night and been getting quite a bit of views so you dolls are loving the vlogs I love that so I'm gonna try to vlog as much as possible but sometimes I feel like it's just I'm not doing anything and it's not like it's not popping but I really like how my hair came out today um it's really cute and I'm gonna do a tutorial for this I used a wand mostly um but I like alternate the curls like some going in some going out and that's what kind of gives it more of a messier look um but yeah I really like it I'm loving my little bob for now I haven't went through withdrawals or anything and for my bang I just used my flat iron but yes it's really cute I'm not about to put on jewelry or anything because I'm just not feeling it but I really wish she would hurry the hell up because she was just supposed to be changing shirts and then we were supposed to be leaving. So I don't know. Some of these comments are crazy and my crazy ass cousin just commented and said, hey dolls, drop some emojis. And it was like a whole bunch of the middle finger emojis and said something like, since I don't miss with my first cousin. And that's my cousin on my dad's side. And I haven't seen him. Um, but um, he actually had came out here recently. And whenever he came and called me, I was asleep. So I missed it. And then I think I was busy. So I ended up not calling him back. And then whenever we did talk, it was like the next day. And he was already gone back home. So, of course, he's mad at me. Um, and it just seems like he always whenever I am busy so I'm usually like not able to answer the phone and I like usually text him and say like okay um, you know like I'm doing something right now I'm gonna call you back whatever but <clears throat> I'm putting Versace up in his pen oh and I didn't even put on perfume you okay so yeah I'm about to go spray me some perfume on real quick he's probably gonna start going crazy because he probably think that I'm just putting him up and I'm not going nowhere. Let's see. I think I'll go with my fave. I got my boobies all on the camera. Gonna go with the Fantasy Britney Spears. I think. Oh yeah, I still have another bottle, but I probably need to pick up another big bottle. But yeah. So now I'm ready. I'm about to leave out, so I will be back with you dolls i'm not even gonna bring my camera back so so it's literally like four o'clock and i have not eaten a thing today at all all i did was drink a little bit of water and i really didn't even drink a lot because i was kind of using the water bottle as a prop i have um i think i showed you dolls before but i had got these really cute water bottles a while ago from the dollar store and they kind of have like an ombre to clear like it's a color at the bottom and it ombres up so it kind of looks like the liquid that's in there is you know whatever color or whatever but i have like a blue one there's one that's like a yellow green and then there's a hot pink so i use the pink one as a prop for my makeup tutorial today it's for the intro just to make it really cute and stuff um and then I just kind of like did some poses. <laughs> yeah, I just kind of did some poses so I can get some stills from the video to use as pictures. But I think everything turned out really good. I had this look in my head and I was like, okay. I kept thinking about it every day and I was like, okay, Cooch. And yesterday I planned to film, which was Wednesday. Today is Thursday, like I said. But I was thinking, okay. I'm going to film on Wednesday. I'm going to film my makeup look and then I'll just do, you know, some of my fashion videos and other stuff. But whenever I woke up yesterday, I felt bad and that's probably why I didn't vlog at all. But I really stayed at home in the bed pretty much all day yesterday. I didn't edit or anything, but I felt pretty bad. And then whenever I got up, like when I first woke up, it was pretty early, like 8 o'clock. So I'm like, okay, I can go back to sleep for like an hour. So I woke back up around nine. And then I think I ended up actually getting up around 10. Um, and whenever I went to the restroom and I looked at my face, I was like, no way am I filming today. For one, I have a little 
problem area right there and it was really bad because I had a dry spot and whenever I tried to kind of flake off the flakiness or the dryness I messed it up and I kind of made a scalp on my face which I tend to do all the time so I really need to stop doing that but um, it was really ugly so I was like not feeling that but then I had bags under my eyes and whenever I had woke up like the first time and whenever I actually did get up I felt like I did not get any sleep the night before like it felt like I just really wasn't asleep at all like I didn't get any sleep so whenever I had those bags under my eyes I was like okay yeah this not gonna work so I um why did I go this way so what I actually did was I just ended up laying back down because I really wanted to take another nap so I can like get rid of my bags and I started to feel bad like not only the bags things but like I said I didn't really feel that well and then I just kept going to the restroom like TMI but I didn't throw up or anything but I kept going to the restroom and then Versace was throwing up too so then when I talked to my mom she was like oh y'all yeah, must have had like a little airborne virus or something because y'all were both sick like and Versace kept throwing up quite a bit I don't know I don't know what we had but we good today because Versace haven't threw up and I feel better. My bags are gone. Um, and actually last night, like I'm on a horrible sleep schedule right now. So I really tried to go to sleep at a decent time so I can get up pretty early today and start filming and stuff. But what had happened was I couldn't go to sleep last night. So I was up pretty late again, um, but eventually I went to sleep and I find that Whenever I can't sleep, even if I turn on something, like I watched this old movie that I used to, what are they doing? Please do not come over here. I watched this old movie that um, that I watched when I was a kid. I don't know if you guys know about this movie that's called The Borrowers, The Borrowers, but that's what was on last night um, on one of the movie channels and I just was flicking through and seeing that it was on, so I watched it because I was like, oh my God, I think I remember this movie and I ended up watching it but it's like these little bitty people and they kind of basically like steal all of the humans stuff but they call it borrowing and they live in the humans houses or some of them live outdoors in different places in the sewers and stuff like that but it's like a kid movie but it's not a cartoon but I used to like that movie so I watched it and I thought I would watch a little bit and then just go to sleep because I've seen it before so no my ass was up i watched the whole entire movie and it was over and i was still up so then i watched youtube and what kind of helps me to go to sleep sometimes with makeup tutorials and stuff i'll be like too into it that i won't go to sleep but sometimes i will if i'm super tired but what helps for me to go to sleep is listening to interviews i don't know it's really weird but lately if i get up and i can't go back to sleep or whatever i'll turn an interview on on YouTube on my computer and I'll just have my laptop in the bed so last night I was listening to sometimes I listen to breakfast club but sometimes you know that could be crazy because Charlemagne is a damn fool so I'm always laughing my ass off at him but um, last night I was listening to Hollywood Unlocked with um, Jason Lee I believe and Melissa Ford and all of them or whatever and Rosa Acosta was on the show but I really didn't make it through much of the interview because I was asleep like it really put me to sleep fast so I don't know it's weird but that's what I be doing when I can't sleep I'll watch YouTube or whatever so I'm on my way to the place I'm always in the car rambling but oh so that's what I was saying we're gonna go and smoke to tonight um, but this evening around 6 or something, India is supposed to go somewhere. So if she doesn't end up going, then I guess we could just go and smoke after we go and eat. But if not, then I will probably go home and film some more if I can. Because if I'm super full, I'm probably going to need a break and just have to wait until later to film. But all I really have to do is do my try-ons. I just try on the clothes so I don't have to talk or anything and I usually just turn some music on.
try on all the stuff, vibe out in front of the camera and just like, you know, model the clothes for you dolls. But that's what I need to do. And also, like I said, if I do my doll discussion or doll dilemma video, then that'll be a talking video as well. But I do not know if I'm going to do that. But it is very cloudy out. It's really dark. I don't know if you dolls can catch that on camera but it is super cloudy and we're supposed to be getting some really bad weather here oh i'm just sitting at the light and it's green honey but we're supposed to be getting some really bad weather here um they even said that it could possibly be like a hurricane i'm guessing a small hurricane like nothing to evacuate for but somebody told me something about a state of emergency like it was really bad but I don't know because I have not watched the news which is really bad but my mom usually keeps me updated or friends or whatever so I don't know I guess we gonna see but it's a little windy today and it's um looks pretty cloudy like it's gonna rain but it was supposed to rain yesterday and I don't think that it rained in my area but I just seen a few um little drops fall on my window so I guess we're probably gonna get some rain today but I doubt it that it's gonna get really bad like that. Oh, and I'm so excited because if you guys don't know, I've always been loving Mayweather and watching the fights. And the fight comes on Saturday. So I had forgot all about it. Like I was pumped, amped, waiting for the fight, but then I kind of just didn't remember that it was already coming up. So um, there is a concert this weekend and Louisiana and I was kind of thinking like that might be nice like maybe I'll go out there and go to the concert but then after I was reminded that the fight was coming on I was like oh hell no like honey I gotta be in front of the TV for the fight even though I already know what's gonna happen I know Floyd is gonna win he's not gonna let me down but I have to see the fight like I've been keeping up with his fights for so long now it would be really weird not to see it so, um, my mom is probably going to get the fight at her house. Well, I'm sure she's going to get the fight at her house because we already talked about that. And we're going to just fix like some little finger foods, like, um, fry some chicken wings and, um, I'm going to make some nachos and we're going to do like sandwiches and like little stuff like that. Um, you know, chips, dip, all that type stuff. So that's what we're gonna be doing saturday so i'm excited for that but yeah i'm pulling up to the place so i don't know let's see if i see india's car here whoa they need to fix that so yes funny story is i used to eat at this place like every single day um for lunch like when i was working for probably like a whole year straight almost i ate here like every single day for lunch except if i would like beg to go somewhere else but somebody loves this place so much that i used to have to come here every damn day so i have not wanted to come at all but i really wanted crawfish etouffee and um other than this place the only other place that I have really ate crawfish etouffee at is at Papado's. Um, and India suggested here, so I was like, alright, that's cool. So, yeah. I'm waiting for her to pull up. Oh, look what my cousin said. Oh, love you, doll. <laughs> that's so cute. I love him. So, my dad and his dad are brothers. Um... My dad did pass away whenever I was in fifth grade and his dad actually passed before he was born um, and who's the oldest I think his dad yes his dad was older than my dad but yeah so yeah that's my cousin I love him I think for India to pull up I'm hungry as hell she need to hurry up you dolls are loving my um, makeup look. I'm so shocked that I did this because it is so bright and bold. I'm almost kind of like, 
girl you about to wear that outside but i love my bright crazy colors and it's cute and it complements my shirt <laughs> i'm about to call her but um my phone is messed up if i put it on speaker it doesn't ring loud like the ringer is all the way up and it doesn't ring loud i have to get a new phone because um shit. i don't know what happened What happened with my phone i don't think i got any water in it or anything but something is wrong with the speaker if i put it on speakerphone um it's low like i really can't hear the person or if my phone is ringing it doesn't ring loud because that's like the same speaker so my phone is fucked up and basically since i have t-mobile i did call them to see about you know fixing the phone or exchanging it or whatever they could do to try to fix it or maybe if my settings were messed up, which they were not. But my phone is still under warranty with Apple. So they pass you off to Apple. So whenever I call Apple, it's just it's just a mess. Like I feel like I'm probably extra and I just want to switch it out and just get another phone for one also because it broke right there and i feel like that might have something to do with why the speaker is messed up because it is like right there and you know on top of where the speaker is but with t with um apple they want you to actually um send in your phone um and of course you have to restore it and you know like back it up and all of that but i can't back up my phone because i never have enough space on my computer or on the phone or whatever the case is but um i can't back it up so i always go to the store with my new phone and they switch over the information for me so i find that as the easiest option i don't have to worry about doing all of that extra stuff but clearly i can't do that so i may have to um back up some stuff on my laptop to a hard drive and then try to do it um but then still that's probably not going to fix the problem so then i would have to send my phone in for them to repair it and i'm sure i would get it back with this little crack at the bottom which is annoying as hell because i would rather just kind of just rather do an insurance claim and get another phone and know that my phone is going to be fixed so i don't know that's what i may end up doing but i was thinking about waiting because the new iphone is coming out supposedly next month but i want the plus if there is a plus i heard there's gonna be but um i would want the bigger option and i don't think the bigger one is gonna be out um quite next month or if so it's gonna be a little bit of a wait plus there's not gonna be a release of a whole lot of phones you guys know how it is with the with the first release only a limited amount of people can get it and it's like going through it to really get the phone so um i don't know what i want to do but i will probably end up just having to insurance claim and get another one i still have my six um it's a six plus it just doesn't have the s i don't know why i upgraded to the six s plus instead of the six because it's basically the same supposedly the camera is a little bit better but um, I need to get rid of my six. I should just sell it because I just, I'm just holding on to it and I'm not going to use it. And that one also has a little crack at the bottom. But I don't know. I may put it on my um, website to sell. I'm always talking about shit I'm going to sell on here, right? But I may as well get rid of it because I'm not going to use it. But oh, do you all do you? Blah, can I talk? <laughs> do you dolls like my eyeballs? My eyeballs. I have on contacts today. I'm probably gonna start playing in contacts a little bit more again, just because recently on Snapchat, they have all these filters with contacts and I'm like, mm, that's real cute. And I remember I used to wear contacts in middle school and then sometimes on my YouTube videos for fun. So I got this new pair from Pinky Paradise. They look really similar to a pair that I already owned. Um, but I'm not sure. I think these may be a little bit more gray toned and the other ones that I had were more blue. I'm not sure. These may be the exact same ones. But 
yeah i got these contacts and then i also ordered some really inexpensive lenses online as well um in a lot of different colors so i'm waiting for those to come in hopefully they are pretty good because i paid super cheap for them but the sad part about it is the seller stopped selling them right after i placed my order so then i was like contacting them like yo is my order gonna go through because you don't have the items up anymore or whatever but they were like yeah your items will be sent they just removed it but i guess it's because it's so cheap and you're not really supposed to be selling them like that i don't know but the contacts were only like five dollars per pair so i'm waiting for those to come i ordered them off of ebay so if you guys want to go and look on there maybe you can find a different seller that sells them at an affordable price but i remember when we were in middle school i would get the contacts and i would pay like 20 dollars at the beauty supply store and it was just basic contacts you know change the color of your eyes but now they have all these fancy ass ones and stuff so yeah get my umbrella out because it looks like it's gonna rain so i'm gonna bring my little mini and we're gonna go in here and eat because india just pulled up and i'm starving and she took forever today like i don't know what i don't know what the hell she's doing because she's usually super fast but i will try to get my camera back out and film um we'll probably get a table because usually at the bar it's a little it's a little harder to film i think she just hit my damn car okay I'll be back okay so how about we just came here and we just did the same thing that we did the last time when we changed our mind because after i looked at the menu like i haven't been here in a long time and whenever i used to come i never paid like i was coming with someone so i don't i didn't really know what their prices were but for what they're charging it's basically the same as papa Do's, and i would rather go to papa Do's. so i was like this shit costs the same like i thought this was cheaper like you know it's not like a franchise like papa Do's. and papa Do's is the shit so papa Do's is right up the road so we gonna go head over to papa Do's, and i'm gonna get my crappy shit to fade that i've been wanting because to me that place is like a lower level papa Do's, so their prices should be lower level but literally for the crappy shit to fade it was like $18 and I think at Papa Do's it may be like what 20 or maybe it might be a little bit more than 20 but it's Papa Do's like we're gonna see how much it is but I think at Papa Do's it's only like $20 or at the most maybe like 25 but I don't know I'd rather I'd just rather go to Papa Do's because I feel like it's too it's too close over there there should be like eleven dollars or something like i ain't feeling it so we're gonna go on head on over here even the bread that they have is like it's like cheap bread like i don't know i just never used to want to go there all the time but somebody just had to go there and i always preferred papa Do's because that that food at that place tastes more like somebody cooked it in a kitchen at home versus like a restaurant style so i guess it depends on what you really want but i prefer papa Do's, so we gonna go on ahead and head on over here to the papa Do's. Mm -hmm. and we almost there and india said she would rather just go ahead and go to papa Do's too because she can get a drink i didn't plan on getting a drink this early but Knowing me, knowing me, I'm gonna get me a little drink. <laughs> so we're already here. Papa Do's is not that far, so we're gonna pull on up to the Papa Do. I don't know. I tried to show you dogs the sign, but I don't think it worked very well. And there is nobody here because it's like the weirdest time of the day. Um. You know, like it's early for dinner, but it's after lunch time. It's like 4.30 now, so. Yep, we're about to go in here and eat. Hey, dolls, so I got my food. Fried crawfish and crawfish at Tupé. Swamp thing, some water. India got some boiled shrimp, potatoes, and corn. 
so. For a little. This is about to be so lit. Spray some spray over it. No, let's go make it some money. Bitch, we is not going home first. We going straight up there because ain't nobody well, about to be in, in the car. Who leave. would? Nobody in there. I want some lashes. You know how to do your own lashes now. No, I don't do them good. Just put yeah, I have friends on. like this. Like, I showed her how to do her lashes. I gave her, like I gave her like a collection of lashes, lashes. and I still got to put the lashes on. Just today, I'm going to put them on. Day after tomorrow. I'm gonna make them last for my overnight. Okay, I already in the pool. I already got the glue. Yeah. I tried some different lashes today. He's cute. They I like look at um, them. They look silk, different than your like one. mink lashes, kind of like silk fiber. So it's not the, the lashes I usually I know. Love. I can tell. But it's another I brand. You, all the time. you like these better other ones? They cute though. The other one's my favorite, but these cute too. The other ones are thicker to me. They look thicker. The ones, that, the ones that I usually wear, I feel like it got more spaces in between, but yeah, I just wanted do. to use a different like kind because I always use the yeah. other ones. So. Thank you, though. But yeah, these came from a company, so I can't remember the name. So the other one's not me? No. I don't think They're no. both cute. Bitch, I can show you how to order you some ink lashes online for like a couple of dollars. Wait, they on e they got them on like eBay. Is it shining or no? You need to do what? This it's shining or no? Cause you said it wasn't. Uh, yeah, I can tell, but it looks kind of like it's just silver. Oh, cool. Yeah. Well, thank you, girl. You're welcome. Um, you put makeup on? Uh, whenever you put your makeup Not on. Not a lot. But whenever you put your makeup on, like if you get it over it, mm -hmm. what I always do to clean it off is like that little eyebrow brush thing I gave you. Just uh, like, like clean it on top of it to get the makeup off. Well, of find it. time to tell me, bitch. Well, bitch, oh, I don't know. Be able to do. I like listening to what you're saying. <laughs> <laughs> like I turn the mic on. <laughs> like find time to tell me, bitch. Yeah, just you use it. Or sometimes I use a Q-tip and put like some alcohol or something mm, like, and go on top it. of it. Yeah. So yeah, it can shine really because the makeup, makeup will cover it up. Broke out down here, but right. I know my period about to start in about a day or two. You go come tomorrow the next day. I tried a new foundation. It only cost like seven dollars on mine. Mm -hmm. It's sticking out. I feel like it's sticking out. No. Oh, oh, India got her nose pierced, y'all. Let me show you. Let's zoom in. She got her nose pierced. We went um, last week to get her nose pierced because, you know, she was scared in the motherfucker. She didn't want to get it done. <laughs> that shit didn't hurt at all. <laughs> Mine's been hurt either. I don't think nose piercings really hurt, but I've you seen some people say, say it hurt. A dude's dick is little if they hit can go in your nose. 
If that can go in your nose, then honey, that is like, that's smaller than a baby. Like, what can I do with this? This dude I used to mess with, I bet he's pretty. Oh my God, oh. hell no. For real, for real. Here she go, sex talk, every time. Every time. I'm just saying. That's like the size of a straw. Like, look at how skinny. Like, no. They can go in your nose. Yes, they can go in your nose. And if somebody thing is this skinny, that's smaller than a baby. They hell hell to the now, to the now, now. To the now, 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 now. <laughs> like, that little boy weenie is probably bigger than this. No, like, what's the little boy No, what is he saying? What? The little Hello. black boy. Hello, motherfucker. Hello, motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, motherfucker. <laughs> Bro, the way he said it, that shit was happening. Well, hello, motherfucker. Oh, that's what some it people were saying. Night tonight. That's what on I my last vlog, y'all was saying at the hookah bars that y'all have, they have like music and drinks and stuff. We have a place like that too, but we don't go to that one all the time. It's gonna be lit tonight. The Most of the time, we like to go to the chill one. That one is chill. But um, at the place where we go, they usually play music, but that day when they go uh, my blog, they didn't really play a lot of stuff, so, yeah. But she have drinks and stuff too, but not like a bar. They just have wine and wine like wine coolers, smearing off, stuff like that. But at this other place, I have to bring y'all. You know what, we, we should give smearing off sometimes, you know, do nothing here to help give us you a buzz, kids. Yeah. I just thought yeah, about if you that. drink a little bit and you smoke hookah, you gonna be. But the last time whenever I went and I had my love smearing off, it was a little lit. You were like, uh, bitch, I am filming. <laughs> Can't let y'all in on all of the tea. Just a little bit. Mm -hmm. I still want to have my life and be a little secretive. Yeah. Because yeah. they don't like, y'all be want to know everything. But yeah, I'll take y'all when we go to the other place one day. But the other well, the place that like we go to. to that's our little lady. That's our mama. Mookie. Mookie be hooking us up too. I didn't see it. Because the last time she didn't even make us pay whenever we switched the thing. Bitch, we didn't pay the last time before that. We walked back. Thank you, Mookie. Yeah, Mookie be coming through. But I wish she'd be like, who on me? Who on me tonight? Bitch, that's what I was. We done time. been a million times me. because her ass still ain't never did that. The fact that I'm hiding the camera with this bag and they looking at us crazy. <laughs> Just a typical Thursday. It seems like a Friday. Yeah, it do. I'm so full. Bitch, I'm trying to finish my whole drink. Okay. I am too. I'm going to drink all this. I pay for this shit. I got a little bit. I feel, I'm feeling it. Drink a little bit. We just getting lit. That's all. We okay. Is your pants okay? Cause the motherfuckers tight as fuck. You childish, bro. No SIM card emergency. What the fuck? Yeah, I gotta touch my phone. What the fuck is going on? It's probably just like not picking. I like this color. Thanks, son. Pretty. You put all three. That's a lip gloss. Cake. This the lip gloss? This oh. lip gloss. These liquid lipsticks. Cute. It's good. Got a little mm -hmm. buzz. Mm -hmm. People probably think I'm talking to my bag, like. <laughs> Cause I literally yeah, have my food. You know, <laughs> so, you know, I got my food like, right behind the camera. 
okay. and it looked like I'm talking to my food bag because I'm looking at the camera. But I don't give a damn. I'm trying to vlog. This man think you bipolar. He probably do. So talk to yourself, girl. I'm talking to my bag, my food. I gotta make sure my food good. So we about to go. Your water. I know. Let me drink some. I need to drink some water. Just a little. Alright. Skating out. How you gonna be looking crazy? I don't even see nothing. Yeah, oh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, wait. I need some more matches for at home. Let me tell y'all when y'all go to Papa Do's, get these matches and keep them in your bathroom. Because if you go to number two, you just strike a match or two and you won't even be able to smell it. Especially if you spray some air freshener afterwards. Girl, what picture? I don't know. I've been having it. I tried to um, exfoliate it off a little bit, but I don't know. It looked like it rained. It did rain. Oh, my camera fogged up. Can't even see. Alright, come on, bitch. I'm about to keep this point for you. Put my lashes on. Right quick. Bitch, you better wait till we get to Mookie's. Why are we just gonna do it now? So when we get to Mookie's, we can hurry up and go in and smoke. You can do it inside of the shop at Mookie's. Fuck no, bitch. I don't Why? know what I'm being, though. Hell no, bitch. Oh, wait. It's today commit comedy? No, that's Thursday. Oh, okay. Yeah, because we don't like going when it's comedy day. Oh, my makeup is popping, bitch. With these eyes, though. Y'all, let me tell y'all, I was born with green eyes. Y'all probably not gonna believe me, but I was. And my eyes Wait, changed. hold on. You might be for real. I, I can't remember. What thirsty is it? I don't... This girl really in my car to get her lashes put on. It might be this thirsty. I hope it's not. I think it is. But hold on, wait. Let me tell y'all. Me, you, and Terry did they? Was that last week or week before? Remember when we, me, you, and Terry pulled up when we had to go to Sky Bar? When, you know. That was a Friday. Oh, yeah. And we said they do it on Fridays now? Yeah. Oh, well, so I'm lost. Oh, yeah. Mine. Get y'all some matches. I always get mine from Papa Do's because why pay for matches? Like, you can come here and just rack up i wasn't out but i just like to carry them and i keep some in my purse too these peppermints melted keep some in your purse so if you go in a restroom and it's funky or if you gotta go number two you can strike a match oh yeah oh yeah Um, hurry up because my bud's about to leave. Look at look at this. A whole bag. This with all these lashes and stuff thing. that I gave to her and stuff. Girl, what is this for Breeze? Oh yeah, girl. That's for my car, girl. She had, had some mud and shit. What you bought another what kind? Called? What you mean? You said a pink thing. No, the ones you came they, they in. Oh, they that's the ones the you want that's Come in on. that pink thing. Yeah. Y'all, I gave India, like, all of these lashes that I used to get, like, from eBay, like, those really cheapy lashes, but they're good for beginners, and she's learning how to put on lashes, so, um, I was putting some lashes on her the other day at home, or at my house, so, I just gave her all of these because I don't know. I decided to just try my camera just to see if it'll come on. I'm sure it's gonna die again soon, just because I don't think this battery really has any life left on it. But, um, or maybe it might have just fucked up and, and, you know, shut off, even though it's not dead. But we're going to hookah now. I did put India's lashes on. That would have probably been fun to watch. I don't know. But, um, yeah, I had gave her a lot of lashes. So for her to practice and just, you know, like lashes to wear because I wasn't using those anyway. But now we're gonna go to hookah. It is starting to rain a little bit. It's drizzling very slightly, but it looks really dark, like it's gonna pour down. Um, but the 
good thing is that hookah is indoors so it doesn't really matter if it's raining or not and we're gonna go there my stomach is hurting a little bit from the drink because it's really sweet i don't know why drinks that are sweeter flavored do that to me but yeah i'll just give me a water whenever i get to hookah but yeah we're gonna go to hookah um and i just I just totally like chewed off all of my lipstick and kind of rubbed it off because my lips were looking a little chapped. Bitch, do not do it. My lips were looking a little chapped, so I was trying to like exfoliate lightly with a towel and kind of rub it off the um, the pilliness. But yeah, um, I had to put my lipstick back on. But I am loving this eyeshadow look like oh my gosh like cooch you did that like cooch you did that <laughs> but yeah whenever I was like thinking of this idea and then I was thinking like pink lemonade like it was just so perfect and I was like yo I have to do this like I have to do this and I was happy that the idea that I had, I was able to incorporate some of my new items. Like I said, I ended up using the same lid color from my yellow look, but I probably should really get off the camera because people are driving fucking crazy. Usually it's like five o'clock traffic, so it's like six o'clock, so it's still some traffic from people getting off from work and stuff. But we're about to pull up to hookah, so I will bring my camera in my purse just in case I can get a little bit of footage for you dogs, but probably this vlog is pretty much over because I didn't bring a backup battery I really need to okay so I might have like a little bit of footage to record we're here it's lit Okay, doll. So I think let me turn my lights on. <clears throat> so I think I told y'all that we're supposed to be getting a storm here. Did India pull off? I think she did. Yeah. So I think I told y'all that we're supposed to be getting a storm here, but I really don't take it seriously because they always say that we're gonna get a storm and it's never bad like that. The last time it wasn't anything. And to me, if it's just raining and stuff and you don't have to evacuate this you know just rain like it's just a little a little razzle dazzle so people have been going crazy people have been posting it all over social media and also since i was snapping and some people know like what area i live in some people are asking if i'm okay and stuff like that and to me it's just like not bad because it's not raining the wind is very chill like it's not windy or anything so to me though those are signs that it's not gonna be bad, right? And the last time so many people went out and bought like all this water and like stocked up on all these groceries and stuff. And I didn't go out and buy a damn thing because I usually stay pretty good with water. As you guys know, when I go to Sam's, I buy a lot of water because I do drink a lot of water, but I didn't go and buy anything the last time. So today, people have been saying all this stuff about this storm and supposedly tomorrow, supposed to rain a lot and like get pretty bad so things should be good for me as long as the lights don't go out I'll be fine because I'll be able to like play on YouTube and I can edit and all of that type of stuff but if the lights go out then that's pretty much it for me unless I have um but yeah if the lights go out that's pretty much it for me so India was saying that she was about to go to the store to pick up some stuff and I was like okay I guess I'll go to the store and pick up some stuff too like just so I can have something to eat because if the lights go out there won't be anything that I can eat at home like I don't really have any snacks left like chips nothing like I ate everything so I will be totally out of there and then I was thinking like well it'll be okay because I could just order a pizza but if it's really bad Nine times out of 10, they probably won't be delivering. So 
a pizza might be out of the question because they may not even be delivering so yeah i decided okay i'm just gonna go and pick up a few things like <clears throat> pick up some stuff so i can make sandwiches and have like a few little snacks and stuff <coughs> so as soon as we're walking in the store of course they have the watermelons outside so automatically i was like let me get me a watermelon because that's a good snack for me um and actually my mom had bought a watermelon and we usually split them but i didn't go over there and get my watermelon and that was i think she had bought it way like sunday so yeah it's probably getting a little bit old now so i just decided to give me a watermelon and then i picked up a few things oh there's the newscaster reporting the news in front of a store but um but yeah so i picked up a watermelon and oh my god let me tell you there was like no water at all except for like those big jugs that you well not even a big jug but like those waters that you carry around with you not the regular bottle size but you know like the double size they only had some of those left like everybody had bought all of the cases of water it was totally out which luckily i already have water so i'm good on that and i have juice and drinks at home that's like the one thing that i do always have is a lot of drinks so i was good on that and then um i said okay i'm gonna get sandwiches right so i got my lunch meat and all of that and my chips and stuff so then when we got we were going to get in the line and i was like oh shit, i didn't get my bread so we go back to get the bread and the bread aisle is effing empty and i was thinking that i was like yo i bet they don't have no bread because that's like that's like the easiest thing that people will eat at home if the lights go off or something like that is a sandwich because you don't need a microwave or anything you can just make your sandwich and literally eat it right so there is no bread and india was like well maybe you should just stop at the store on your way home and pick up some bread and i'm like no i'm not going to another store i don't have time for that so i found this bread that is like um kind of like sub style bread but it's really soft from what i felt i haven't tried that kind before but i found the one that didn't have the sesame seeds on it because we used to buy bread similar to i believe what i found and i used to make like sub style sandwiches all the time but i didn't get any lettuce because i don't want to be extra i'm just gonna make regular ass sandwiches but they're gonna be a little fancy so i had to get my fancy bread and then i picked up some other stuff so i'll show you dolls what i got when i get home but i am going home a, um, a lot later than what i actually plan to because i do still need to film my try on portions for what i filmed today so luckily i'm glad that i didn't go crazy and film a lot of fashion videos today i actually only did two and one of the companies is only a couple of items it's really not a lot of stuff but one of the companies is quite a bit of stuff so kind of like two or three hauls together because it's so much so much stuff that i have to try on but luckily that's all i have to do um because i am kind of tired and then also i was supposed to take versace to get his haircut today and i ended up not taking him so the lady said that he can come tomorrow but she wanted him to come around lunchtime and usually i'll go and take him in the morning or sometimes I would take him at lunch and then pick him up in the afternoon but um she requested lunchtime because she has some other dogs coming in so if it's raining then versace not going to get his hair cut tomorrow either because i ain't got time and she she is really anal about the weather because actually the last time versace got his hair cut we were supposed to have a storm and she had like um canceled his appointment and you know like put it off because the weather was supposed to be bad and it didn't it wasn't bad at all but yeah i'm glad i found what i needed at the store and i got me some snacks and stuff i was planning to just get sandwich stuff and then you know like the chips because i have to have chips with my sandwich but i ended up picking up other snacks so that'll be good because i'll have some stuff that i can munch on and i got something i can eat for breakfast and yeah then just sandwiches like i didn't get any other type of food i started to get like some boudin or something but if the microwave is not working if the lights do go out then that won't be possible so i didn't want to get anything like that so i'll just have sandwiches and then if the weather is not so bad 
you know, or if it's legs up at some point, I can always come to my trusty dusty water burger or I can always order a pizza. So I'll be good to go with it. And I was thinking like shit. Maybe I shouldn't have ate a sandwich yesterday because I ate Jimmy John's whenever I was sick yesterday <clears throat> and I um, didn't want to leave. I stayed at home, so I, I ordered that because Jimmy John's delivers, which is bomb. But I feel like a sandwich is different every time, especially if you make it at home. It tastes different than it does like at a sub shop and it can change up your whole sandwich depending on what chips you eat with it. So sometimes I do switch up my chips to make it taste different. So I'll usually eat like regular Lay's or sometimes I like to do the jalapeno chips or jalapeno, jalapeno, however the hell you say it. Um, or then I also like um, Doritos, like um, Cool Ranch Doritos. I love Cool Ranch Doritos, but I don't particularly like ranch unless I'm eating like celery or something. So yeah, I'm kind of tired, but I'm going home now. I need to check my mailbox too because I had ordered um, some edge control and I know it came in the mail, which I could have probably just went to Sally's and bought it, but I'm lazy and I hate going to stores and shop sometimes. I'd rather just shop online. It's cold in here. I'm stuck at this light. But yeah, I just, I just think it's so crazy when people are going crazy for a storm and I would much rather be prepared so I mean I guess in a way it's a good thing but it kind of shows you that people don't have shit at their house already because they go crazy when a storm is coming to go and pick up stuff but honestly I wasn't going to go to the store and buy anything but since India said she was going to the store and we were both you know like I had to pass the store to come home anyway so I was like okay I guess I should probably get some sandwich stuff just in case if the lights go off but whatever and I have my food left from last night so if last night <laughs> I have my food left from earlier so if I get hungry tonight then I will just eat the rest of it or I can save it and eat it tomorrow but it's really not a lot it's literally like a snack because I had a lunch portion because the dinner portion is really big and I tried to eat as much of it as I could because that's all that I ate today. So, yeah, it's like 10 o'clock. Well, 10, 20-ish. So, I'm going to go home, check my mailbox, um, go take Versace out and finish filming my videos. And then I want to chill out and watch some shows. On Thursdays, I love to watch Wildin' Out. Um, what else comes on? Oh, Queen of the South. <laughs> of course, Queen of the South. I don't think I watched it last week, actually. So I need to catch up um, if I didn't watch it. But I usually just turn my fire stick on in my bedroom and lay in the bed and watch back the shows that way. Because I don't have my box in my bedroom set up to record. Only the one in the front room. And sometimes I don't like to go in the front because I will lay on the couch and literally go to sleep. So, yeah, I'll get back with you dolls in a minute. So I'm home now. I think I do have enough juice to enough juice to finish off my vlog because um, I actually did have a charger in my purse that can work for my camera. So in the car while I was vlogging, I was charging. So hopefully we can make it through. I just want to show you guys the stuff that I got. If anyone is interested in the snacks and stuff that I like, maybe something you may want to try. Or maybe something that you already like. So, first I'm trying to open this package with my little edge control. So I can show you which one I got. The one that I get at the salon. The one that I get at the salon was, um, she took it home and to use with for her kids or whatever. So, she has to order me another one and she was going to be out. So it's probably going to be a while. So I ended up just getting another one, which I wasn't actually out of the one that I like, but I wanted to try this one because I know a lot of people like it. So this is by Design Essentials and this is the Sleek Max Edge Control. Like, why don't they make these things bigger? I wonder how much is in the one that I buy from the salon, but... I mean, I guess this is like standard size. It's clear. 
It smells good. Kind of has a fruity scent. I was scared that it was going to come in the mail and be like upside down in my um, mailbox. And then it would be like melted on here. But it wasn't. It was right. So thanks for that. So here's the stuff that I got. Here are the things that I got. I did get my contact solution since I'm wearing contacts. And I was running low on my contact solution that I already have so i picked some of that up i believe that's the same kind that i already have i got my popcorn this is the boom chicka pop in the sweet and salty kettle corn i also do like the blue bag which is the regular butter popcorn but they didn't have it so i decided to try this one out this is by central market this is like heb brand and this is the movie theater popcorn so like butter popcorn so i got that to try i don't know if i'm gonna like it but i got my lunch meat i just got a small pack because this is temporary like okay so i got my lunch meat and like i said they didn't have any bread so i got these little rolls they're called steak rolls so the camera actually died but i just plugged it up to the charger right here so we're gonna have to work with a little bit of distance but i got these they're called steak rolls or sandwich rolls to me yeah sandwich rolls and they feel really soft so i think i used to eat these though like when i was in school and i would make sandwiches a lot i got me some pickles kosher velastic um i got some apples the green apples that are already sliced i love apples and then i got me some jello i like the one that has the fruit in it so i got the dole mixed fruit in the black cherry gel or jello and then i also got the peaches in the strawberry gel so i got those i got some candy just because i love the sour patch kids extreme the blue ones are so good and i also got my gummy bears because i love those <clears throat> this is like my fave chips so I got that and I got the big bag. They didn't really have a lot left, but then I also got some honey buns cause I can eat this in the morning or I can eat like fruit or whatever, or I can have a honey bun and then eat like some fruit or apples or whatever. And then I did get a watermelon, which is kind of hiding, hiding over there, but it's actually quite a big watermelon. So I'm going to cut that up and everything. So that's all I got. I really didn't get a lot and it was probably like $40. Groceries are high. So I'm gonna go so I can get some things done and I need to put this stuff up so yeah I'll probably vlog tomorrow if I can and let me do a proper outro so thank you dolls for watching the vlog and I'll be back with more really soon night dolls